I think it was a sense of wonderment that, oh boy, this is, so this is what we have for <laughs> the nuclear winter. Mm -hmm. uh, and then there was kind of a sense of, you know, shock uh, about what had happened to the Capitol uh, and uh, with the Pentagon and the World Trade Towers. And uh, I think there was also just a sense of uh, uh, confusion. Um, and, you know, the, the members felt very nervous in the leadership because they were, they were, uh, there was the leadership on both sides, the House and Senate. Um, and they were a little, they were isolated from the rest of their members. And for a leadership, that's not at any way where you want to be. And so there was a, a desire to connect as quickly as possible with, with the rest of the members who were, you know, basically, you know, if you have, let's say, 20 members of the leadership in both the House and Senate, you've got, uh, you've got, or maybe 30, you've got, uh, you know, 405 members who are <laughs> kind of, you know, uh, vying for themselves and trying to figure out, you know, what to do. And, you know, these, there was no real kind of direct understanding of where those members were going to be going. So a lot of them were, uh, were going to the one place where that seemed to have information, which was the Capitol Police headquarters, because the Capitol at this time had been, had been completely shut down and all the office buildings were shut down. So members really had nowhere else to go. So um, as uh, I think the members uh, in the leadership were trying desperately to figure out, okay, what, what's, go what's happening? Why are we here? Um, one senator in particular, Don Nichols, did not want to be there. He wanted to be back home and didn't want to be in a secure location. He thought it was kind of ridiculous. Um, and, you know, I think that there was, there was kind of this tenseness of, of the situation. I remember walking in and uh, there, by secure phone, Karen Hughes, uh, uh, the, the, actually the members were being briefed by, by Vice President Cheney. Um, and, um, but I remember Karen Hughes being on television trying to brief uh, the public what was going on and the, the the it was very it was very surreal because the the um, the uh, television reception wasn't that great and um, you know kind of uh, everyone was very very kind of on edge um, and uh, anxious